These are the best 4K monitors for video editing in 2021. Welcome to Monitor Verdict. Number 3. Acer Concept D CP3271K As you'd expect from the Concept D range from Acer, the color accuracy on this display is exceptional, with 90% of DCI-P3 color gamut and a Delta E variance of less than 1. I think for the price they should have gone further than 90% of DCI-P3 and 400 nits brightness but achieving 4K UHD with HDR400 in 144Hz on a 1ms IPS display is impressive enough to justify it if you're a creative type who needs high accuracy and high frame rates in the same monitor. Number 2. Asus ProArt PA32UCGK on the high end of creative digital media monitors, the PA32 UCGK is everything you could ever want or need. With 1600 nits peak brightness and 1000 nits sustained across the entire monitor, the brightness can completely overpower any glare. HDR10 provides a 1 million to 1 contrast ratio, and this mini LED IPS display is capable of 10 bit color, a Delta E variance of less than 1, and 98% of DCI-P3 or Rec 2020 color spaces, 100% of Rec 709, or even higher in Adobe RGB and sRGB, which is completely completely unparalleled at this size and resolution. Even the refresh rate is uncompromised at up to 120Hz. This isn't a gaming monitor, but if you wanted to build the world's most expensive gaming setup, here's the monitor for you. Of course, with all those pixels, you'd expect to see the best of the best connectivity, and amongst other ports, you'll find a HDMI 2.1 and DisplayPort 1.4 on the back. This is undoubtedly the number one monitor for video editors, but if your budget is, for whatever reason, below $5,000, there's a QHD version with almost as perfect colour accuracy too. Number 1. LG Ultrafine 32 UL 950W As a number one option on this list for Mac compatibility, this is everything that a visual media creative needs to accurately monitor and shape their creations. With 32 inches of 4K UHD screen real estate, you'll have a long timeline and a detailed viewport in Premiere or Final Cut Pro or DaVinci Resolve or your editing program of choice. And with 98% of DCI-P3, it's well suited to a range of creative professionals. Even the color at Pixar. Now that is a solid recommendation if I've ever heard one. And for when one screen just isn't enough, you can daisy chain two 4K monitors together through Thunderbolt 3. And it has thoughtfully integrated control with Mac OS for brightness and loudness control from your touch bar. And if you're interested, there's a 5K version as well. That's probably enough pixels at that point, right? If you have any questions or recommendations, please drop those in the comments. And if this video helped you, remember to hit like and subscribe so maybe I can help you again sometime soon. And thanks for watching Monitor Verdict.